Instagram and Facebook, they're essentially infidelity machines. You know, I get a lot of emails from guys who are upset because their girlfriends are all over Instagram and they've got thousands of followers and they've got guys dropping DMs all the time and they're speaking to guys and they won't stop because they're getting a lot of validation and attention on Instagram for the oldies, it's Facebook, right? People reconnect with girlfriends from the past, boyfriends from the past, people that they shouldn't really be interacting with, they're now interacting with them. And Facebook and Instagram has essentially allowed people to just become much more unfaithful and to cheat very easily. And in the same way, you know, I say that Facebook and Instagram are infidelity machines, but they're also machines for spotting infidelity. A guy's cheating on a girl, be very careful because the girl you're cheating on will most likely go through your Instagram and she will go through all the photos and she will try to find anything suspicious. She'll even reach out to other women on your Instagram and just say, hey, I'm this guy's girlfriend and what's your relationship to this guy? They just do that. And then they'll say, hey, I just had to know. I know it wasn't right of me to do it. I know it wasn't good of me to do it, but I just needed to know. I needed to know that I could trust you. They'll do that. So in the same way that Facebook and Instagram are infidelity machines, they also will sniff out infidelity. Now, to get back to the point of this video, I had a guy who just emailed me recently and he said that he was upset because his girlfriend was always on Instagram and she wouldn't give him access to her Instagram. She said, I want to keep my relationship and my Instagram separate. Now, he's thinking, you know, what's going on here? Who's she talking to? Who's she spending all this time talking to on Instagram? She's getting a lot of attention. There's a reason why men should be worried about this because I've seen it so many times where women will go off with a guy they met on Instagram or Facebook, a guy who reappears out of nowhere or who appears out of nowhere, just sees the photos, likes them, and lo and behold, before you know it, she's talking to this guy and then the guy is wanting to meet for drinks and then the girl does it out of curiosity and then she catches feelings or she catches some kind of interest and it just spirals from there. A lot of times men who meet women on Instagram are now worried that this girl's going to meet another guy on Instagram and of course you should be worried because if she meets you on Instagram, it's not too difficult for her to meet somebody else on Instagram if things don't go well. So before Instagram and social media and Facebook and all this kind of stuff, women didn't really have as many options. You know, there weren't the dating apps, there wasn't social media, women would stick around. They weren't really interacting with that many men. Now a beautiful woman can interact with hundreds, thousands of men. It's very easy.